The first table to look at is the classification table for block 0. This is the block of the model with no predictors entered. Here, we can see that the model can correctly predict 66.7% of cases simply by predicting that no individuals had left. The omnibus test of model coefficients in block 1 shows how the model changed when the control variables were added. We can see that the chi-square value in the model row is not significant. This indicates that adding the control variables did not significantly improve the ability of the model to predict which employees would leave. Next, we have the Hosmer and Leem show test. This assesses whether the model is significantly different to a good fitting model. As the test is non-significant, our model would seem to fit the data reasonably well. The block 2 omnibus tests of model coefficients show how the model changed when the variable of interest, job satisfaction, was added. We can see that the chi-square value is significant in the model row, which indicates that adding job satisfaction significantly improved the ability of the model to predict the employees that would leave. The model summary table underneath gives R-square equivalents for the logistic regression. Generally, both are reported. Under this, we have the classification table for the block with the control variables and the job satisfaction variable added. We can see that the new variable is 90% accurate, a clear improvement from the 66.7% accuracy of the model with no variables. Next, we look at the table for the variables in the equation. We want to look at the X, B column for the significant predictors. This is what's called the odds ratio. This represents the change in probability of our outcome variable occurring. In this case, the change in probability of individuals leaving the workplace. A value of 1 means no change in probability. A value greater than 1 indicates that individuals are more likely to leave, while a value less than 1 indicates that individuals are less likely to leave. We can see that job satisfaction has an odds ratio of 0 0.076. This means that a one unit increase in job satisfaction is associated with a 92.4% decrease in the probability of individuals leaving the organization. Below this, we have a plot of the observed groups and predicted probabilities. This is another means of assessing the fit or the accuracy of the model. Here, we can see that as the predicted probability of individuals leaving increased, the number of individuals that we observe leaving also increased. This indicates that our model has good predictive accuracy. When reporting these results, you would generally report the omnibus test of model coefficients, both R-square statistics, the Hosmer and Leemshow test, and the coefficients and confidence intervals from the variables in the equation table.